Okay, going for, for kill run with Red Death. Using only three max weapons. Uh, so, of course, using this one. Uh, just two weapons. Uh, it doesn't quite work for survival. Red Death is super fast, so being able to get the other stuff is key, too. That is my uh, theory behind this. I'm going with the furniture drop. Oh, that works. So, I might actually cut this one out, because I don't know that the... I'm just going to do it on this run. I'm not going to get the health recovery on the far left. Um... I don't think it really helps versus getting uh, floor chickens from the spawns. So that's why uh, Labora helps because of uh, grabbing a track orb, uh, which is key for being able to get, once you're in tight space, still being able to collect the experience to get floor chickens to survive the ending. Um... I don't know how well this will actually work at the very end now, because last time I did it with Bone, unrecorded. Um, of course, it works by bouncing them and then keeping them from getting too close. Furniture kind of does that, but it falls from above. So, don't know. Don't know, actually. We'll find out. Um, so, getting kind of the... The staples, getting Candelabra, uh, Eraser, since this stuff kind of throws, it kind of helps with the stuff. Um, I'll be getting Critical for the Scythe, as well as Bouncing for the Scythe, uh, for the Arcanas. And, uh, so Spinach, uh, the Gold Bar thing, whatever that's called, and getting the 100% increase in enemies and speed. I'm not getting the other increase in enemies and speed um, because it seems like there's too many of them with health and so even though there's more to kill I'm not able to actually kill a higher number. Once I get comfortable with this I might try it again and see. Candelabra is the other one, and uh, of course the Tract Orb. And cooldown, actually. So I was able to get... Nice. 186. 185, 187k. I didn't record it. Um, I do have third right now on the leaderboard, um, which I got using uh, Rune Tracer because the armor helped me uh, stay alive longer. Uh, at least I think it was that. I'm not so sure I can't. No, I think it, mm, no, I got that with, uh, with the guns. Uh, so having the uh, extra lives, the revivifies is what made me last all the way till the end. Uh, but I found between the Santa water upgrade and Scythe, the upgraded guns actually doesn't do a whole lot of damage. Compared to if I didn't get the uh, revive item and instead got uh, another item, a complement. So that's been what my exploration has been doing. What am I missing? Cooldown. Gotta get cooldown. Go. 
Got everything already. Means I can grab the ring before the gold bar goes to 100%, so it'll be faster to kill this the uh, guardian. Grabbing a track orb so that I don't have to go as far to grab these things and level up faster. I should grab spinach there. Uh, since I've only got three weapons, I try and level up the weapons a little bit faster. It helps with survivability. because I can always run into Santa water. I'm experiencing some difficulty. Alright, weapons are max. Leveling up the spinach first because it does higher damage per thing rather than the gold bar. Get the spinach out of the way. Close am I? Right. Oops. I'll get that. Ooh. That's probably nice. Interesting. Sometimes we'll choose to go ahead and level up the gold bar before I grab the ring so I can get a couple of floor chickens from experience to deep up my health uh, before the 10 minute, especially. I've got to survive the reaper and clean from it. The sand water is a little bit bigger. Should go faster. You get on health on more than half. You got a lot of time. The seven minute thing's about to happen. Grab it. 
think that's the only one I'm gonna grab. Let's see how it goes. Going down so that the furniture is hidden more stuff. Going the path. Going for the uh, 100 percent increase to get more enemies sooner. Get the uh, labor out here fast at ten minutes. Which is the main damage dealer. Oh, there we go, guardian super here. So now I'll just do a slow progression down, letting the labor kill things off the screen, or simple water kill things off the screen. And furniture continue to die. I don't know where this is missing. I've not tried this yet. of how fast uh, death's default movement is. Definitely doing some stuttering. But yeah, furniture is just clearing my way. Okay, here we go. Nine minutes. Be interesting. Bone zones and other enemies automatically scale the longer it goes. I'm not sure if they also scale with your level. Okay, I gotta watch out to keep distance from you. So not every now and then to collect. Okay, this is working pretty well. Oh, I move too fast. Where did he? I don't see him. Bora. Uh, 
some to me. Another advantage of the death is being a lot faster than the green death. Oh no! For a second. Doing just fine though. Oh no! The heat is pure above. No! Get right behind still. Five seconds. Now to get um I've been getting bounce first. Then at 21 and getting critical. I don't know if that's a bad, bad idea or not. Let's see which one comes up first. Oh well, that's already right there. Let's just grab it. Okay. All the rerolls, so that doesn't matter. Alright, one more progression now. surviving the last minute. Red Death instead of getting the gold bar because I'd have less in the night and area and projectile speed. Those all seem really good things for these items. I could instead go with Spellbinder and go and grab both of the uh, increased amounts for 95, 90 total. It would be 10 less. if I could end up doing more damage that way with uh, the increased duration of items. Be an experiment. Did I miss a chest? No, it was 13 minutes, so there's about to be time. Okay, not that it matters, I don't need chests, but... Basically 80k at 15.
Put the volume down on this a little bit. to it and do I risk it I'm gonna keep going I can always do the run again and do it Am I going to hit a hundred K at 17? Don't need chest. Wait. Oh, that's not even a chest. It's... Seems good. I haven't paid enough attention. What numbers I'm gonna get at work minute markers? Not the 21 minute chest, so they're in there. I stopped zigzagging because I realized it was uh, picking up way more experience. So, just in case that does matter, I'm not going to do that.
19 minutes, 114. It is being bounced around so much at that. Oh, it's right on top of me. Bam. Alright, so getting critical. I don't think there's anything I can do. I mean, that would give a lot more furniture. Well, it would only give one more furniture, but three more size. I think critical is definitely. Definitely the way to go. Uh -oh. Got red. I'm just gonna cash, I guess. Got more golden eggs. Those stupid cards. So if Bracer, the, the uh, Labora moves a lot faster, which is nice. I'm just moving and staying in it, just in case the printer doesn't knock the side of the settings.
Twenty three minutes I believe the shooters start to appear, yeah. So I'm gonna go side to side to get those appear now. Top leaderboard. It's like 199 or something. The next one's 183. I think 183. So getting 200 would be lovely. But definitely getting uh, above 183. What I'm really aiming for initially. If I don't have any trouble with that, then getting another, getting the other ring. It would probably be the next one. and a half minutes to get 10k. Should be a good problem. slow down a little bit. Getting the two columns on the other side of the, the spitters. There we go. Hmm. stop moving at this point. Not that I had to stop moving. This seemed more beneficial. This, I think, moving is better. Definitely didn't get past 183.
Yep. That's second place. seconds here. Basically right at 190 at one minute left. Alright, so this is where Track door is going to play a part if they're able to reach me. Which, between Scythe bouncing off from and Furniture bouncing off from, they can't. Oh wow. So, yeah, I'll definitely do the next run grabbing the other ring. Like, I don't even need these. I literally can't touch my wonder if I should risk moving down. Oh, Venture's not reaching me through the... Oh. <laughs> hey, yeah, let's not do that. second though no won't, won't hit 194 close and there we go 193.59 wow wow Death Spiral did the most damage, but that's because it was up the longest. Interesting. Feels like La Rapa did a lot more, but eh. definitely helped uh, staying alive. Pretty interesting. <laughs> 